Yeah, I just I thought I'd do a quick video response to Professor Anton conference report, both talking a little bit about this language thing, um, words, uh, the fact that we have different metaphors, different perceptions of what a word is, what it represents, how to conceptualize. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, so this. The language is broken. He has. He won't. He'll never say that. Uh, it's stuck with a bunch of archaic crap, uh, misdefined because of the world people lived in. They were. It was dark when it was dark, and so they were afraid of the dark and blah 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 and whatever. But anyway, um, the, the point I wanted to get to it, and again, he goes back to this: we're not a pen. Yeah. Well, we all know we're not a pen. I know I'm not a pencil either. I know I'm not a rock. I mean, you know, these distinctions we can make. Uh, but we do know what we are. I mean, you keep trying to run away from the what we are part by comparison, comparison to something else that we aren't. And uh, you're playing the same game as the word game. Now, you know, let's reverse the metaphor. Okay, instead of um, being pissed off that six million people died in the Holocaust, let's just say... Well, at least it wasn't six billion. You know, let's reverse it. Let's imagine six billion people dying in the Holocaust. And then six million is like, oh man, that was a cakewalk. No problem at all. And so, yeah, let's just shift the metaphor, shift the, the perception. And so, yeah, compared to a pen, we're pretty spectacular. You're, you're right. I'll, I'll grant you that. Compared to a fucking pen, a human being is pretty spectacular. Uh, but compared to uh, an ideal thinking computing machine, we're not so spectacular. Compared to, uh, I don't even know what to say, you should have to do, make, make the comparison over a period of time. But I mean, comparing you know, modern civilization to what we were a thousand years ago, uh, yeah, uh, those people were fucktards, assholes, morons. Um, where else am I going with this? People distracting me, running and such. How dare they? <laughs> well, how dare they do the same thing I'm doing in this part? Seems totally ineffective. I mean, uh, inappropriate. Um, anyway, uh, yeah, back to the metaphors. Yeah, so this is the trap of the whole thing. It's these inconsistent definitions and this change of emphasis. And I guess that's what a lot of it comes down to is a change of emphasis. I mean, somebody left a comment on one of my videos, you know, arguing that life was love and uh, holistic and sustainable and, uh, you know, all the, all the little Gaia-type type gooey, gooey words, um, you know, that completely deny the, the nature of the beast, the consumption, you know, the predator behavior, the cannibalism, that is its nature, all of those kind of words. Uh, and that's really what it all comes down to, is just this, this, this propaganda that's sort of built into the way we talk. And, uh, you know, it does make things difficult. But, I mean, it's really propaganda. You know, when, you, when you're comparing human beings to, to, to pens, to find an excuse to say... Oh, what they're doing is so fantastic. I mean, that's, you know, that, that's bullshit. Um, I mean, obviously, I don't have something to compare it to on the other end except to say, look at what we've done with our intelligence. Look at what we've done. <laughs> you know, uh, yeah, we write stories. Those are pretty good. But that seems like basic. You know, those, and those are just emotional things. They're just emotional candy um, we flew the moon. It was good, but it wasn't, you know, I mean, <laughs> you know, um, and the rest of it's just crap. The rest of it's bubble gum and, I don't know, uh, what do you call that? You know, milk you don't have to put in the refrigerator, uh, vacuum-packed coffee. I mean, <laughs> what's the rest of our accomplishment? Um, you know, I'd almost argue in some respects, well, no, I wouldn't argue it. Never mind. I mean, in some ways, you know, I, I guess I'll say it. Uh, we're kind of past our prime, actually. Uh, you know, 
it does seem like there aren't any new Mozarts. Like we really don't have the, you know, there is something missing. Uh, but it just might be that, yeah, Simpsons did it. We've we certainly hit that brick wall. Simpsons did it. You know, <laughs> I mean, we're, we're sort of almost in that. It's almost like that with these videos. It's going to be a point where, oh yeah, in Mindamori made that video. You know, once I make five or ten thousand, <laughs> yeah. It'll, somebody will be pretty, there has to be we are going to get redundant and be same old same old so whatever um, I just I just don't get this constant effort to compare us to look we're not a dead root yeah we're much smarter than a dead root we're doing something much more interesting than a dead root it's not a root it's a vine but whatever you get my drift. <sighs> mm, a <little> tense. <sighs> yeah, better. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <sighs> oh, yeah, sorry. I'm better now, so I don't really have anything to say. Um... Um, I gotta quit doing that. Yeah, I gotta quit doing that. So anyway, until next time, I'll hit the button. A little moment of peaceful reflection. <sighs> yes. But they're all chasing the sun. They look like they're doing something else, but that's all they're doing.